Welcome to Pre-Math. In this video, we are going to solve this given exponential equation 3 power x minus 3 power y equals to 234 and make sure that our x and y are positive integers. Please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe. So let's go ahead and get started with the solution and here's the very first thing we are going to do. In order to solve this equation, we have to manipulate it. So therefore, let's focus on this part, 3 power x. And here I have copied it down and I can tweak this 3 power x by just adding and subtracting y. So I'm going to subtract y and at the same time I'm going to add y as it doesn't make any difference so now let me just go ahead and put this thing x minus y together and now let's recall this product rule of exponent so this could be written as 3 power x minus y times 3 power y so therefore now this 3 power x could be written as 3 power x minus y times 3 power y. So therefore our this equation could be written as 3 power x minus y times 3 power y and then minus 3 power y equals to 234. And now we can see that 3 power y and 3 power y they are in common so we can factor them out. So therefore we can factor 3 power y outside and inside the parentheses we're going to have a 3 power x minus y and then minus 1 equals to 234. And now let's focus on this number on the right hand side 234 and here I have copied it down and here it is their prime factorization. 234 could be factored into 2 times 3 times 3 times 13 and now we are going to rearrange these numbers I'm going to put 3 times 3 together and 2 times 13 together and here I wrote down 3 times 3 together and over here 2 times 13 together and now 3 times 3 could be written as 3 power 2 and 2 times 13 could be written as 26 so therefore I am going to replace this 234 by this 3 power 2 times 26 so the right hand side is going to become 3 power 2 times 26 and we can see the left hand side is going to stay same and now by comparison I am going to equate 3 power y equals to 3 power and likewise 3 power x minus y minus 1 to this uh, 26 so therefore we can write 3 power y equals to 3 power 2 and on the other side now 3 power x minus y minus 1 equals to 26 and now we can see that the bases 3 are same on both sides so therefore we can equate their exponents so therefore this is going to become y equals to 2 and now let's focus on this other equation let's add 1 on both sides this negative 1 and positive 1 is gone so we got 3 power x minus y equals to 27 and now we can tweak this 27 27 could be written as 3 power 3 so the right hand side is going to become 3 power 3 and the left hand side is going to stay same now we can see that we have 3 on both sides at our basis so therefore we are going to equate their exponents therefore I can write x minus y equals to 3 
but we know our y value is 2 so I'm going to replace this y by 2 so we can write x minus 2 equals to 3 let's move this on the other side so we are going to get x equal to 3 plus 2 that means our x value turns out to be simply 5 so thus our solution turns out to be x equal to 5 and y equals to 2 thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos bye